Right, in this video I'm going to explain about several things related to grade 6 activities, yeah? Compared to the other levels of grades, uh, 6th grade is quite different because normal days, when you have normal school days, uh, basically you're going to have lots of activities in grade 6, yeah? Uh, but because of this situation, uh, your activities at home will be quite different than usual. First of all, I'm going to explain about yeah, the book, yeah? We still use the same book, which is Happy Camper 6, yeah? This is still flip book, and I'll explain later. And, um, yeah. For our home learning activities at home, as usual, when you were still in grade 5, I'll provide some videos for your learning. And at the other time, we'll have face to face interaction. It can be through Zoom application or Google Meet. So, next time, we'll have uh, real interaction, yeah, live Zoom meeting or like Google Meet yeah, next time. Uh, I think I'll see you next week via Zoom, yeah. So let's just wait next week. And for your activities in grade six, especially for semester one, yeah you're going to learn some units yeah normally you're going to learn wait unit 1 until unit 4 yeah unit 1 until unit 4 but considering that we only have short period of learning so i will ascend sorry i will speed up the learning sessions so probably in semester one, you're going to learn four until six units, yeah? There are six units in semester one, yeah, probably. Semester one, you're going to learn about circuits in unit one, yeah? Unit two, about movies, yeah? I, I guess everybody likes to watch movies, yeah? You're going to find out more what the movies are like yeah unit three you're going to learn about clothes yeah any kind of clothes sweatshirts sweatpants cardigan vest leggings and many more unit four types of movies yeah there are so many kinds of types of movies such as action yeah drama horror science fiction etc Unit 5, Solar System, Unit 6, Technology And for the rest of Unit, Unit 7 until... I guess until Unit 8, yeah? We're going to learn them in Semester 2, yeah? Okay, in Semester 1, um, as usual, we're going to have tasks, pre test so in one semester there will be four tests and four pre-tests too and in the middle of the semester you're going to have a um, midterm test and then in semester two yeah this is quite different yeah you have to be more diligent than before <laughs> because you're going to work hard for it. In semester two, uh, there will be no midterm test. Yeah, in semester two, uh, once again, I repeat, there won't be midterm test. So you're just going to have final test, yeah, English final test in semester two. And apart from it, there will be practical tests. Yeah. So what are the practical tests? The practical tests are speaking tests, the first one, and then the listening tests. 
in semester two next year, yeah? So you're going to do these tasks, these two tasks next year in semester two. Yeah, hopefully the situation is getting better so we can meet each other and we can do it easily, yeah? Because during this situation, it's really hard for me, not only for me, but for you too, it's very hard, yeah? To learn together. And one more thing, yeah, about PLBG, yeah. So remember, yeah, PLBG, Pendidikan Lingkungan dan Budaya Jakarta. We still, we are still going to learn about that, but with different topics, yeah. I'll tell you what we are going to learn in PLBG next time. So for the PLBG assessment, yeah, PLBG assessment, uh, I will assess you through speaking activity yeah so for example after i teach uh, the pal busy topics i will ask you to record yourself and i'll assess your speaking ability yeah, like that and you send it back to me your videos and i'll assess your your skill yeah okay guys and probably during the home learning yeah I'll also give you some assignments, yeah. All these short and easy assignments, which can be done by everyone, so it will be very easy for you. And for our communication, yeah, uh, I use WhatsApp and Google Classroom for what is that? How do how do we call that? Uh, for daily or monthly or weekly communication you can use a good classroom yeah so i'll put everything like for example tasks tasks and other stops related to learning into one platform which is called google classroom so i am sure that everybody has joined Google Classroom, yeah, and I'm also included there, and I'll teach you through Google Classroom.